Hey, this is Felicia for Sports in the Bay, and I am here with Joe Hawkins, who is the co-founder of the Oakland Community LGBTQ Community, Community Center. Center. Did I get it right? You good. Yes, you yes, I did it. <laughs> so tonight is an important night. The Golden State Warriors, they are, they are honoring the LGBTQ community, and this is the first year that Joe Hawkins and his guys are here set up in the Section 118 here at Oak Arena. So talk about it, how important. Well, what's really amazing about it is it's the first time an LGBTQ anything has ever been featured and fundraised for by the Warriors. So this is only the second LGBTQ night that the Warriors has ever had. So last year it didn't fall, they had like another um, recipient and it wasn't an LGBTQ group. So we are that group. So we're history, this is history. Talk about briefly what it provides for people. I know that we've got a lot of youth yeah. on the street, been kicked out of the house, and um, you know they're trying to find their way. Talk about what kind of support. Not, you know, we provide support to families okay. with children, because queer fam there are LGBTQ people. I have a son, my mm -hmm. son is 35, I have grandchildren. So from young children, uh, transgender people, youth, to elders. So our center serves the full breadth of our communities. So we, we feel like we came along just in time. I'm honored to have found you. Your guys were wonderful. Great information here. I got my pen. Tell me yes. where they can find Donate Support. OaklandLGBTQCenter.org. You can just, if you Google Oakland LGBTQ, will be the first thing that pops up. All right now. All right. Thank Anything you. else? No, thank you so much. We're just having fun. And thank you, Warriors. <laughs> Thanks. Tonight was filled with a lot of excitement, and fans even had a chance to see Alicia Keys, who sat courtside with owner Joe Lacob as the Warriors rolled to 9-1 with a 116-99 victory over the Minnesota Timberwolves. But you know, the important message tonight was that about the LGBTQ community. I had a chance to ask Steve Kerr before the game about inclusion. With the current climate in the world today, how important is it for tonight that like the Warriors are acknowledging the LGBTQ community. Can you talk about that? Yeah, I mean, it's something we're very proud of, um, you know, with the Warriors. I, I think uh, just celebrating diversity of all kinds, uh, inclusion, um, respect, respecting everybody, respecting others, um, respecting our differences. So this is something the Warriors have been doing for several years, I think, uh, since I've been here. And uh, I was uh, very proud that uh, we take part in this and we lead the way on, on many of these issues. And, uh, and so, yeah, it's a good night. And the Warriors return to the court here at home this Monday against the Memphis Grizzlies. Tip-off is 7.30. And as always, thank you for following me on all of my social media outlets. Here at Oracle Arena, this is Felicia Purcell for Sports in the Bay.